I'm Thomas Baldrick at ATS 2015 here in Denver. Pleasure to have with us Allison Whitkin from Massachusetts General Hospital. Thank you for stopping by. Thanks for having me. All right, so your hospital began a, a pulmonary embolism response team. Mm -hmm. What is it and what does it do? Yeah, so about three years ago, um, a group of physicians, um, Dr. Chanik uh, from the pulmonary department as well as um, cardiology, emergency medicine, noticed that our management of patients with pulmonary embolism, particularly large pulmonary embolism, wasn't uniform and it wasn't really clear who was making the decisions about how to treat these patients who should be making these decisions. And so what they basically did is designed a multi multidisciplinary team with members from the ICU, pulmonary, emergency medicine, cardiology, cardiac surgery, hematology. And now when one of those patients comes in, they're seen by a fellow. And then in real time, we do a multidisciplinary conference call and come up with a strategy for management that includes everybody at once. Um, and it really has changed how we manage patients with pulmonary embolism. From a uh, providing a care standpoint, how has it how has it helped? How has it changed things? So I think it makes it a lot easier for the primary team. Um, they're not wondering who should we call. Um, we give a cohesive plan. We follow these patients. And from a patient standpoint too, I think they you know feel good knowing that it's not just one doctor who's been involved with making this decision it's a team of doctors and we're now also providing follow-up care for them after they leave the hospital to make sure that issues like ensuring they have full recovery from their blood clot and anticoagulation are fully followed what are the critical features of this program so the critical features are the timeliness that we do these consults 24 hours a day seven days a week doesn't matter if it's 2 a.m on a saturday um, we're available to do this the multi, and I think the multidisciplinary nature, that we really have insights um, and ex, from experts in the management of pulmonary embolism throughout the entire hospital. So obviously it's great for the patients. In, in terms of this spreading across the country or around the world, what are your thoughts on that? Yeah, so it's actually, it's been one of, for me, a really exciting aspect of the program is we started it, but a lot of other hospitals are very interested in it. Mm -hmm. And actually, um, in just a couple days, we're having um, our first, uh, we call it PERT for the Pulmonary Embolism Response Team consortium meeting with, I think about 70 people from various hospitals around the country coming to learn about how we do it so they can bring this out to their own hospitals. Fantastic. Appreciate your time. Thanks for stopping by. Yeah, thank you. Okay.